What's up, y'all? It's Mel, baby. <laughs> um, I came back today. I have an itch more hog. If you don't know what that is, it's an Asian supermarket. One of the biggest chains. Like, there's one here in Dallas. There's one in Seattle. There's one in, um, what else? San Francisco, I think. I'm not sure, but we have two of them here. All three. So that's what I want to do. And I'm going to show y'all my grocery haul. First off, I have some spare ribs. I don't know how I'm going to cook them, but um, I got that little pack there. I'm probably going to put them in a pressure cooker dinner oven. I got that. And I have salmon bone. And yes, it's the middle cut with the bone. A little piece of filly and skin. I'm um, supposed to be doing a hot pot today. And I have boneless pork loin. One of them, it had to be the ribs. Because one of them was leaking. It leaked on my hand. And I was, yeah, I was having a fit. And right here I have marinated beef slices to go on the grill. Now, this is where uh, my uh, groceries differ from my woman's because she's carnivore. I'm not. Yes, sir. <laughs> oh, I also have these fresh quail eggs. And I'm not trying that with her. It's 18. I premium quail eggs. I'm gonna enjoy those. <clears throat> How do you eat them? How you eat eggs? People fry them like regular eggs? Yeah. Oh. Then I have some stir fried kimchi. Oh. Oh. Some firm tofu. brought some lemons. Look how big these lemons are. Yeah. And pretty. And these was only, um, I believe, $2.99. You know, everywhere else, five lemons is like $6. Yeah. Um, they're nice and pretty. Let me go in here and show y'all what this is. Oh, this ain't nothing but zucchini, y'all. <laughs> I'm gonna have me heck of a hot plate tonight. Hot pot, hot pot, hot plate. Call it what you want. <laughs> okay. That's two different things. Two now different I got things, this other bag over Hold here. Hold up, come here. It's kind of heavy. I can't really pick it up because you know, as my children say, I'm old. <laughs> bigger jigger old. They call it bigger jigger old. And they overpack these bags because <laughs> they carry them. Okay, let's see what else I got here. I have some mixed mushrooms. And um, I was going to tell you what kind of mushrooms, but they just say mixed mushrooms, so that's the best I could do for you. This is straw mushrooms. That's, that's the best I could do. These right here, I believe these are Korean mushrooms. And this is also, these are from Canada. I have some sliced dried shiitake mushrooms. That is my, my ish. Oh, I brought me another knife. Put that down. Let's see. Ah, a long spoon. 
You know when you're making your sweet tea? Orange watermelon. It look weird, but it might be good. I hope these seeds are mature enough. That you could just eat them like regular watermelon? No, because a lot of these things I brought, I brought so I can see one. Oh, okay. Like the watermelon. Okay. I'm not going to, I want all the seeds I could get out the watermelon. Hopefully they're big enough that I can uh, plant some. I brought a, a squash. Not big squash fan, but not yellow squash anyway. But I have all these other squashes. Now I brought these white eggplants, y'all. And y'all know I'm a fan of the eggplant. So this one I'm going to just seed. <laughs> Girl, I thought you were careful when you picked that up. Yeah, I know. He thought I didn't know what I was buying. <laughs> I was like, wow. He thought she just went in the store and was picking up everything. Some red okra, y'all. I'm going to see the few of those, too, but I'm definitely going to eat those. Wow, I only got two days. I got to eat almost all everything. Right. Day. Why did you get all that? Because I can uh, freeze, freeze paw ball freeze. Yeah. And these are pepino melon, whatever that is. Can y'all see that? Here, let me show you. Yep. They're from Ecuador. Don't ask me, but I'll be getting seeds from that too. Anything to have a weird garden, right? Mm -hmm. These are supposed to be Italian eggplant. Yeah. I got me two of those. And uh, I forget what they call this one. Where's uh, my receipt? I just had it. Curtis just gave it to me. Oh, here you go. That's it. It's a graffiti eggplant. Did I want to get one of them? No, I'm going to make sure a graffiti. This is a graffiti eggplant. That looks like that pepino thing. Yeah, I know, but it's a melon. Okay, that's a graffiti eggplant. Chinese eggplant. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Get your mind off though. Come on though. Oh wow. I got some bok choy. Looks like he broke my uh, aloe vera. I got two aloe vera leaves. He did break the tip. But that was breaking off anyway. Some green onions. A bell pepper. And these, I believe, are the Indian eggplants. 
You gonna be eggplant out, huh? Well, you know I love eggplants. Yeah, I do too. I could do a variety of eggplants and just have a, a eggplant in Pepper Garden. That would be lovely. Yeah, you, for the hot pot, you can do all uh, vegetables and I do the meat, you know. You know, you just, you know. What? For the hot pot, you do all vegetables, I do the meat. I mean, you can do vegetarian. You just like me cussing you out. <laughs> And I have a big bottle of sweet chili sauce. I don't even know why I did that because I'm probably going to be the only one eating it. And this is, I think, my I'll fish sauce. Next month. Fish sauce. Yes, you have to use all these ingredients to get the, the taste you're looking for. sodium oyster sauce medium sweet soy sauce and vegetarian stir fry sauce and uh yeah that's about it that's all I got and um it was a nice little group, but I, I appreciated it. All of my groceries came up to a hundred and uh, two. Yeah, a hundred and one oh seven, a hundred and one seventy. Okay, y'all, that's my my uh high mark. Um. Paul, I know it's not what you're used to, but thanks for watching. Y'all be blessed. And I'm going to try to bring y'all more holes in different types. Because I go, I get around. You feel me? Until um, next time, y'all, peace, love, and hair grease. And y'all stay safe out there and be careful. Later.